welcome back we are here with 4th of march golly blessing now you can make any crooked path straight but for that you have to have the wisdom now that wisdom comes from soul consciousness in simple terms it simply means that you should set yourself into a soul conscious feeling and then look at the world through those new eyes not through the physical eyes not through the physical senses but through the soul's eye and try to see things through the energy form instead of seeing them as physical forms so now we are going to understand through god's own words how do we make a crooked path straight for us god says may you be an incarnation of power and make a crooked path straight by experiencing being full now anything which is empty an earthen pot if it's empty automatically it's going to shake around right if there's little bit of water it's going to shake around if there's little bit of anything in that is going to move around a lot but a full pot is not going to move that much so here also in our life if we are not full of the knowledge the power the different virtues which we are supposed to have some situation in our life a crooked situation is going to shake us up so god here says may you be an incarnation of power and make a crooked path straight by experiencing being full remain constantly full of the treasures of powers the powers are power to discern power to judge a situation not just people power to face power to adjust power to accommodate power to cooperate and also power to tolerate so there are many more powers like this power to even focus power to concentrate power to turn around power to put a break to your thoughts and there's so many such powers and then there are virtues there are like around 36 virtues if you just type in brahma kumaris and you find out 36 virtues in google you'll find out what all virtues are there then god says knowledge and happiness so be full of powers virtues knowledge and happiness then with the with your intoxication of fullness even a crooked path will become straight if you are empty on the other hand it will become a pothole and by falling into pothole you could get a sprain now this is not a physical sprain this is a mental sprain so god says those who are weak and empty get their thoughts sprained that means their thoughts go crooked they try to manipulate they try to get angry frustrated they try to mold people around with force by using push and pull and that's a crooked path then god says an incarnation of power means one who takes a contract to make a crooked path straight an incarnation of power we souls are incarnation of power means one who takes a contract to make a crooked path straight those who take such a contract can never say that the path is crooked that means when you are using the right path the righteous path with the knowledge with the power with the virtues with happiness then any path which you see will be made straight you cannot say oh i had to walk this path because there was no other chance we are living in kalyug and this is a bad world and if you are not bad then things cannot be done you cannot move forward in life and those things are not going to come out of a soul who is knowledgeful with powers knowledge god then says if someone falls it is because of lack of attention or because the intellect is not full of those virtues powers they cannot discern they don't have the knowledge they don't have the wisdom and how do you get this wisdom you come over to brahma kumari center and you learn this beautiful knowledge of soul consciousness and you move towards that right path and even if you are faced with a crooked path you can make it straight om shanti this